All right, how to dry up moist carpet, okay? Moist carpet can be done with baking soda, which I'm gonna show how to do it. But if it's like soaked, let's say you left the window open and the rain came through and it got on your carpet here, you're gonna have to use, get a big old, big old bag of uh, rice at Costco or wherever you can get it cheaply. And uh, you're gonna apply it onto the carpet like this. Okay, the wet carpet all over it like this, okay? And I mean a thick layer of rice. Now this is soaked carpet, really. This is supposed to be about moist carpet, but I wanted to cover a soaked carpet also. And you're gonna leave that on there for 24 to 48 hours or even 72 hours. I know it's gonna be unpleasant walking on rice, but it's gonna soak up the moisture in your carpet but, or the, the, the soaked carpet. Now, if it's moist carpet, this one's a little easier. Go get yourself a big old bag of baking soda, okay? And we already see I put some on the floor already because I've got a moist carpet. And you're just gonna just put it all over, all over there, okay? It's nice. Don't be cheap now. Use it up, put it all over the carpet, okay? Then you're gonna take your handy dandy broom here. And you could do this after you do your moist carpet let's say, uh, or your soaked carpet, you could do your rice and then suck that up with the vacuum cleaner and then apply the baking soda afterwards just to make sure you got it all dried up, okay? Now this is for moist carpet. Let's say so you just did some carpet cleaning and it's too cold outside and you can't get it to dry. Well, unfortunately, you're gonna have to put this on top of your, you know, your cl fresh cleaning, but this will soak it up because you don't want to develop mold in your carpet. So anyway, you put the baking soda on there and then you're going to rub it in with a broom. Okay, just like this. Just broom, broom, broom. Broom, broom, broom. I know, it doesn't look too good. I'm using one arm here, what do you expect? Okay, broom, broom, broom. And you just keep rubbing it in until it's just almost completely all gone. Some of the little lumps there, you just rub them in with your foot and then brush them in. Okay. You're gonna put a good thick layer of this stuff on there. And like I said, don't be cheap. Use that bag up if you have to. Because that bag's only going to last a fairly, you know, fairly big room. That's it. You have to get a new one. Okay. And after that, once you get rubbed in nice and neat, swinging the broom back and forth, you're going to let this sit for 24 to 48 hours. And this is going to soak up the moisture in your carpet. And it's going to make it smell clean, too, because baking soda makes everything fresh. So, if it's soaked, put some rice on it. If it's moist, put some baking soda on it. Good luck, God bless, and works for me.